Hello everyone! Welcome to Learn and Share. We are doing word problems and these are going to be related to time. Word problem one. Jim goes to office every day. Today he started his work early in the morning at 6.36 a.m. He took his lunch at 1.27 p.m. How long has Jim worked until lunchtime today? Do you want to try it yourself? Feel free to pause the video and try it yourself. Do you want to see how I solved it? I solved it in a step-by-step -step way. Let's see it. Jim goes to office every day. Today, he started his work early in the morning at 6.36 a.m. So here is the clock that shows 6.36 a.m. He took his lunch at 1.27 p.m. So here is the clock that shows 1.27 p.m. How long has Jim worked until lunch today? So we can solve this problem in parts. In part one, we can find the duration between 6.36 a.m. and noon. In part two, we can find duration between noon and 1.27 p.m. Then we can add these two durations to get the total time duration. So let's take part one, time between 6.36 a.m. and noon. For this, we can subtract 6.36 from 12 o'clock. So here we go. So the time between noon and 1.27 p.m. is one hour and 27 minutes. This was pretty easy because noon is at 12 o'clock and it doesn't go to 13 o'clock. So what I did is from 12 o'clock, I added one hour, which would be one o'clock, and then 27 minutes, which would be one hour and 27 minutes. So, <clears throat> There is 12 o'clock minus 636. But as you see on the minute side, 36 minutes cannot be subtracted from zero minutes. So we will have to borrow from the hours. But what will we get? We will get one full hour. But one hour is also 60 minutes. So, instead of 12 hours, we are going to write 11 hours, and instead of 0 minutes, we're going to write 60 minutes. Now, it's easy for us to subtract 36 minutes from 60 minutes, but wait, you see that over here, at the minutes over here, there's a 0, and 6 can be subtracted from 0. So again, we borrow from six over here and to zero, we will give a 10. So this will become 10 minutes and this will become five minutes. So 10 minus six is four and five minus three is two. And what is 11 minus 6? 11 minus 6 is 5. So we've got the time between 6.36 a.m. and noon. And we've got the time between noon and 1.27 p.m. So all we have to do is we have to add these two times. So 5 hours and 24 minutes plus one hour and 27 minutes is four plus seven is 11 and one plus two plus two is five.
<coughs> and five hours plus one hour is six hours. So Jim has worked for six hours and 51 minutes. Yay, we solved the problem. Coming up is the fun part, and that is... Make your own word problem. Here is a tip. You can use the same word problem and change the numbers and objects in blue to make a new word problem. Here's an example. I started my homework at 4 o'clock p.m. When I stopped my work, it was 8.37 p.m. How long did I take to finish my work? So easy to make your own word problems. For more word problems, click the link in the description box below. Hope you like my video. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you.